Hey guys, me Jacob. Today's video is going to be a review on the Riddell Speed Flex helmet. It's a really good helmet. Um, it's pretty pricey though. It's 500 bucks. I got it for Christmas, and it's actually a really good bang for your buck. Um, it comes with let me get it, uh, a glycerin thing and a pump and a helmet bag. I think I don't know if you had to buy that or not, but that's what mine came with. Sorry, I'm plugging my phone. My phone just died, so I had to redo this whole video. Um, some of the noticeable upgrades is the speed. Like that hinge thing to absorb absorbing face mask, quick release points on each side, the ratchet system face mat, um, chin strap, and the strap lock. Um, so I guess we'll go into breathability. This helmet breathes really well considering it doesn't have those like um, like the liner covering the holes. It breathes really well. And then, so I give that breathability a ten out of ten because it's really breathable. Like I can feel the air as I'm running, like going through my helmet. It's really comfortable. You can kind of see through it out there. Like, yeah. And then durability, hands down, 10 out of 10. I haven't used it, but from people I've seen and heard, it looks like a really durable helmet. So, 10 out of 10 for that. The only helmet that's more durable is this shot helmet, but for Riddell, I like Riddell better, so this is more durable. Um, the most re durable Riddell helmet. So, it's really good. Um, I didn't go like that because my phone's almost out of battery. And then, um,. For comfort, it's a 9 out of 10. The only helmet that I've had that's more, um, more comfortable is the Riddell Revolution Speed, which I have, but I'm selling to my friend. It's downstairs <coughs> in the garage. Um, But yeah, but the only bad, I mean, I wish on this you can. You could, like, take this off and use a different chin strap, but I really want to be able to put, like, a pink chin strap cover on it if I for, for breast cancer awareness, which... I can't really do because there's not really a way to take this off unless I like go in here and get like these little the screw pieces that connect to your face mask that go right here. Um, so yeah, that sucks, but I mean, that's the only thing. Um, but yeah, if you're going to get a visor also, get a Nike one because it fits this, any face mask on this, and it fits any speed face mask. The only bad thing about my, I had an Oakley visor and it didn't fit this or the, um, speed face mask so i gave i just sold it and then um but the cool part is the uh, nike fits both so that sucks that i wish i would have known because the nike i bought after the season so i mean whatever but yeah it's a good helmet um and just looks it looks really aggressive it's a really aggressive looking helmet like i'm sorry it's like comparison like i mean you you can't tell me that doesn't look cool like i mean this looks so cool in my opinion. And my colors are matte white and then um like a gloss white face mask and like these I can actually hear these vibrating these um like once you bang on it, it's like a hollow face mask. Um so yeah, go ahead and check out my other videos. Um I'm kinda of making this quick, it's really late, so not really late, but it's just I'm kind of getting tired, so good padding and everything. You can get it you can use it for ten years with annual recertification. I'm a medium, but the only thing is I had to put some air into the ear pads, and that's it, though. It's a really good helmet, and, like, this black stuff, it's really sick, like, the ear pads are memory foam, like, the jaw pads. Like, this, um, gray one, like, I could just, it's so comfortable, that's memory foam, and then this, um, black stuff is, like, a faster kind of memory foam, so this is, like, slower, it, um, really absorbs impact, and it, um, takes a minute for it to form back, like, I'll press down on it, and and see that like it's still forming back and then this black stuff which i don't know if you can see just like you press down on it and it's like goes back up really quickly so it's a good film overall i give it a 10 9 out of 10 just because the rev speed is a little bit more comfortable but yeah um so yeah 9 out of 10 for me um if i get it it's like it was 500 or something like that my mom said so Pretty pricey helmet, but it's a good helmet. It's it's really good. Um, yeah, it's a lot of bang for your buck. So, yeah, check out my other videos. Comment, rate, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Um, yeah, which is gonna be yeah. I don't know what the next video is gonna be, but oops. Yep. So that's it. Bye.